Krista Donner. Um, I'm an artist in residence here at Yale NUS with Andrew Yang. We're very interested in the flora and fauna and culture of Asia and wanted to try to engage with it in depth. And it seemed like at minimum one way to even just even start doing that would be to take on a residency that might be something as long as six months. Singapore seemed like an ideal place given our interests in nature, the notion of gardens, and the intersection of sort of uh, natural and cultural spaces. We made a proposal around the idea of of the Chinese garden. The idea of the Chinese scholar's garden as this kind of um, entry point to think about nature as a microcosm, all these different ways that humans interact with their environment, um, and how much we do and don't control that. But to expand that to the idea of also community gardens and the everyday ways in which people sort of engage and make their lives around their interactions with the sort of non-human. And because Singapore is global center for community gardens. Supposedly there's over 1,300 community gardens in city-state. Um, it seemed like an ideal place to be able to explore that aspect of Chinese culture also because the garden plays a very crucial role in the way that Chinese culture both spreads but also cultivates and maintains itself. Artist residencies really vary. I think a residency could be any span of space or time where um, that's sort of designated for the creation of of new work or, or engaging in creative research to generate something new. It's often something that artists will do as a way of getting outside of the, their sort of everyday routine to kind of, you know, just have new stimuli. Getting into a new physical space and a context and new people that you're talking with and a new environment that you're interacting with, but also the possibility to have new prompts, right, in a new kind of environment and new kinds of things to respond to. The purpose of art is to lay bare the questions that have been hidden by the answers. Right? And I think one thing that uh, both of our practices have in common, and of course I think many artists, uh, writers, filmmakers, even journalists, is to really try to ask the unobvious question in a sense, right? the thing that one really takes for granted. They're exploring different kinds of assignments around the idea, of course, of the garden, physical and metaphorical. But we're then also going to be doing different kinds of installations, for example, in the library, that will explore the idea of like, the garden and the library, and the idea of cultivation of plants, but also the cultivation of knowledge. I mean, I think this is a really special residency in terms of the duration and just the chance to be really immersed in the in the culture, in the community of the college. You get to know people in all these different levels of both the college but also beyond the college. There's a lot of connections being made. And it's also just the, the duration of it really allows you to kind of dig in and get to know the culture firsthand rather than just being a tourist. <laughs>